Hello, my name is Kyle Peterson. I'm a professional juggler here in New York City. I'm here today to show how to do a spinning plate. A spinning plate comes all the way from ancient Egypt. Um, this, there's two types of plate. There's the plastic plate and the metal plate. Each one has their own advantages. Plastic plate um, it doesn't make a lot of noise when it hits the ground. The metal plate is really unpleasant when it hits the ground. So, uh, and it also could damage hardwood floors. So keep that in mind. Also, times when I'm working with children, if I'm going to be letting the children try the plate, because the plate is a really good thing to let children try. I try to avoid using the metal plate because, you know, they could hurt themselves if they drop it on their head or whatever. So, uh, one advantage of the plastic plate is that it will hang on the stick. Uh, so it's much easier to learn. I recommend if you are learning the spinning plate to use a plastic plate. Once you know how to use it, you will want a metal plate because the metal plate will spin longer. Uh, with the plate hanging, you want to hold the stick at the bottom. I like to have a finger pointed up along the stick to give me a little control. And I start spinning very slowly. You want to hold Your motion when you spin the plate is not making a circle with your arm, but making a circle with your hand. Notice the point of the stick at the bottom stays in one place. And it's the top of the stick that goes around in a circle. To get an idea of how the motion works, practice drawing little circles on the ceiling as if you had a giant pencil. Now, take the stick at the top, start slow. And go faster and faster. As you build up speed, the plate will start to lift. As you go faster and faster, it gets it to the correct position, it lifts up right, and all you gotta do is kind of slam on the brakes, and it'll snap to the center. Now, to achieve this, your arm needs to be very relaxed. I see a lot of people practicing, they're trying to do it. I can see the tension in their arm, and see the white knick knuckles in their grip, and uh, you can just tell it's not gonna work. You need to be really relaxed, very suave. Slam on the brakes and it snaps to the center. Once you can do the spinning plate, there's a whole bunch of tricks you can do. You can put it up on a finger, the famous arm curl. All types of balancing tricks can be done with the spinning plate. Put it on your chin. Throw turn and oh, throw turn catch. It's always a lot of fun. Uh, another fun thing, now, the spinning plate is, this is great for combination tricks. With the plate spinning, you grab a couple balls. Do a little bit of juggling. You could even set up a roller bola. Get on your unicycle. And combine the chicks. Ta-da.